MS PowerPoint 2010. Presenting an idea or topic to an audience for information or imparting of knowledge is called presentation. The Microsoft Office Suite software is bundled with many productivity tools. One of them is PowerPoint. It uses slides to convey information with text, graphics, videos and animations. It makes learning more interesting and informative. MS PowerPoint is a presentation software that enables the users to create, edit and display presentations. It has predefined layouts, themes, templates and multimedia to design beautiful presentations. Opening MS PowerPoint To open MS PowerPoint 2010, click on Start button. Go to All Programs and then Microsoft Office, then Microsoft Office PowerPoint 2010. The PowerPoint window opens. PowerPoint Window Components The main components of PowerPoint window are Title Bar This is a horizontal bar at the top of the window having three components Quick Access Toolbar to the left Presentation Name at the center and Minimize, Maximize and Close buttons at the right Ribbon the broad bar containing icons for various tasks in PowerPoint below the title bar is called the ribbon. Tabs A group of related options forms a tab. Each tab has its own ribbon. PowerPoint has seven tabs. Home, Insert, Design, Animations, Slideshow, Review and View. Group A set of icons related to any one task on each tab ribbon is called group. File tab File button on the left of home tab has options for manipulating files like new, open, save, print, etc. Backstage view with file menu opens on clicking the file tab. Status bar the horizontal bar at the bottom of the window is called the status bar. The PowerPoint window is divided into three vertical panes. The middle pane shows the slide you are working on. The left pane has two views. Slides view shows smaller versions of multiple slides. Outline view shows the text present on each slide. You can edit the content on this view. The right pane shows contextual dialog boxes depending on the options you are working on. For example, if you are inserting images, the clipart dialog box will open here. Creating a new presentation To create your first presentation, you must start with a blank presentation. To create a new blank presentation, first Click on the File tab and from the menu, choose New. A new presentation dialog box will appear. Blank presentation is selected by default. Click on Create button and a new presentation will open. You can start making a presentation now. There are two text boxes on the slide, one with Click to Add Title on it and the other with click to add subtitle. You can start typing and add text in these text boxes. Saving and exiting a presentation. To save your presentation and exit from PowerPoint, click on the File tab. Click on Save option. The Save as dialog box appears. Using the drop-down menu, select the location where you want to save the document. Now, enter the name for the document in the file name box. Click the Save button. This will save your presentation. After saving your file, move to top right corner and click on the Close button. 
Your file is closed now, but the application keeps running. If you want to exit PowerPoint, then first click the File tab. And then at the bottom right, click the Exit PowerPoint command. Opening and running a slideshow. The information in PowerPoint is written on slides. These slides are viewed as a presentation in the form of a slideshow. To open and run the presentation, open your file by double-clicking on it. The file opens in normal view, but you can select other views as well. There are different views in PowerPoint which can be used for running the presentation. In the PowerPoint window, the bottom right corner of status bar has three view commands. Normal is the default view and where all the slides will appear on the Slides tab in the left task pane. Slide Sorter view gives you a thumbnail form. The slides are presented horizontally, which enables you to see more slides at the same time. Slideshow view fills the computer screen with your presentation.